Oh, you guys, I'll need some makeup and some hair. Oh. Hello, all. It's Sergeant No Rep here, the greatest judge to never judge, the one, one time CrossFit Games attendee. And I'm here from Madison, Wisconsin. And I'm, I'm under the bleachers, as you can see. And you may ask, why, Sergeant No Rep, are you under the bleachers? Well, CrossFit came to me and said, where would you like to set up a show? Do you want to be on the concourse? Do you want to be in the vendor's village? Do you want to be ringside or arena side? I said, guys, 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 just imagine the lineups of people that want to see Sergeant No Rep. Like, I, I can't do that. It'll be too much of a distraction. Put me under the bleachers. It creates a lot of security. Um, I think it'll be set up great, and people can still come down and get autographs. Signed out, $100 per autograph. I know it'll probably be $100, so that'd be, or 100 people in the lineup. You'll probably have to wait a little bit, but I'll, I'll sign everything. So, I am here today, and I'm talking about the top five men at the 2019 CrossFit Games. So let's get at this. So number five, I have Cole Sager coming in in the top five. Cole Sager's looked great this year uh, at the Rogue Invitational. He's putting on a great show. He looks fit. He looks set, and he always does well. His biggest setback is he always starts the games really slow. He puts himself in last place, and he has to work himself up. So I'm looking this year for him to have a great show. Uh, stay right in that pack the whole way through. So coming in number four, we have Boom Boom Born Vin Carl Gunmanson. Sorry, Carl Gunmanson, messed that one up. But anyway, he is constantly uh, in the top ten. Uh, he looks well this year after coming back from an injury. Um, so I like to see him break that top five and come in at number four. So in number three, we have a fan favorite in Noah Olson. I don't know if, who's more popular, him or his dog, but anyway, Noah's the one that's going to be in the top five, not his dog, and Noah's had some little mishaps in the game, uh, he's never won an event at the games, so let's look for him this year to break the top three and get on the podium. And in number two, the fellow Canadian Patrick Vellner coming in second. Now, I think Patrick has very much so established stealth as the number two athlete in the world for CrossFit. Um, I think he's going to bridge the gap a little closer between him and Matt Frazier. Um, look for him to clean up all the mishaps he has every year, falling off a net. I guess he couldn't really control a bike breaking, um, weights rolling away from him. But anyway, uh, he's number two. And the man to beat that's not going to be beat is Matt Frazier coming in at number one, winning his fourth CrossFit Games. I really don't see Matt Frazier being beat, um, but like I said, I think Pat Bellner is going to get a little closer to him. So there's my top five. We have Matt Frazier number one, Pat Bellner number two, rounding up the podium is Noah Olson. Uh, number four is Carl Gunnison, and number five is Cole Sager. Now you say... Sergeant No Rep, where is Brent Fikowski, your fellow Canadian? The Mr. San Diego song, where is he at? Well, I think Brent's going to do great, um, but I don't think he makes it to the top five this year. Now, also for this segment, I wanted to do who's going to be knocked out in that first event. A top name that's going to be knocked out in the first event. Um, somebody that's popular, that does well, and I'm just going to throw a curveball out there, and I'm actually going to throw Brent Fikoski out there. Um, he doesn't do great in the open style workouts. I'm not sure what this is going to be like. This is like totally just in left field. Um, cause it'll, it's going to be a lot of the national athletes that are not even going to be able to finish that event. But I'm going to throw Brent Fikoski as my guy that's not going to make it through the first cut. Um, hope you enjoy. Please like, subscribe down below, and stay tuned for the top five women between the two possible.